Clarissa's Kitchen. Today's video is going to be another recipe and I'm actually making a few recipes that involve oats. All these recipes should easily fit into your lifestyle and be quick on the go, so let's begin. bites all we did was gluten-free rolled oats peanut butter honey and you can add any like chocolate nuts or seeds that you like but in this case I put some goji berries in here goji berries are really great for inflammation it helps reduce that and also I always like to eat a handful right before bed because it really helps like calm you um, throughout your sleep at night and just kind of balances out all your hormones let's try it out or haven't tried let's try this out this is like really good okay mm -hmm. 10 out of 10 on to the next recipe Are overnight oats and this is a really simple recipe that I like to make the night before 
the next day because when I open up the fridge, I have breakfast ready for me. And if you guys are busy bees like myself, this is super convenient. We're gonna pop this in the fridge for a few hours or just wait overnight and then we'll give it a try. Several hours later. We got the overnight oats, but I am a little impatient. I kind of want to eat it right now. And plus, it just looks so good. Mm-hmm. Just how I like it. You guys can add more almond milk if you want or any plant-based milk if you want it a little bit more like looser consistency. If you guys want it sweeter, you can always add more maple syrup for that sweetness. But overall, this is really good. 10 out of 10. On to the next recipe. We have our banana blueberry crepes. Let's give it a taste test. Mmm. It's like a little thicker. Not as thin as like a normal crepe, but it has the crepe consistency if that makes sense. Like it has like almost like 
pancake fluffiness, but very thin, because we didn't add any leavening agents like baking soda or baking powder. But oh my God, this is good. I'm gonna get a blueberry. Mmm! Have breakfast for dinner or breakfast for breakfast? Breakfast for breakfast. Wow, this is so good. And there you have it, my foodies. Those are a few delicious recipes that you can make with gluten-free rolled oats. So get those big bags of gluten-free oats deep, deep, deep down into your pantry, pull them out and make a few of these recipes. This took no more than 15 minutes of your time. This was absolutely delicious. And again, if you guys have busy lifestyles just like myself, this is super easy to create. And let me know which one's your favorite recipe that you enjoyed and which one you're feeling like making. And if you guys do make this, make sure that you let me know how it turned out. Also, tag me at Clarissa's Kitchen. I'm on Instagram, I'm on TikTok. I love to reshare all your recreations of these recipes. And again, subscribe right down below. Turn on those notification bells and make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. It really helps support my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time in Clarissa's Kitchen. Bye!